Uh, do you want me uh, Baba Hitchi? Well, well, hello, everybody. It's the Nicole Universe. I hope everything is fine. And I'm a rich and who brings value to my own experiences. And today we're gonna do a walk through the Basmani district of Moscow region and Garokhovsky Periulok. It is sub street of this thing. And uh, we will learn Russian vocabulary. Do you know what is it? It is the electricity suit or electricity room. And inside, uh, and in Russian, it's called Transformatorne Budka. Transformatorne Budka. And it is uh, Miss. Do you know what is it? It is Musarka. Musarka means uh, trash bin and for everything. It is Smeshane Adhode written. It means that this is a Musarka for everything. Like for four combined things mixed. Smeshane means kind of different things inside of it. Adhode means uh, leftovers. And uh, here is the tree, Dereva. Here is the Kustarnik, a bush. And also the grass, uh, Trava. <laughs> the the Bata I, I mean that uh, it is uh, not the Bata Oa, it is uh, a tin, a tin of uh, water. And uh, it is Piva, I think so. It is a beer. It is a tin of, of a beer. And one girl, she's She's a девочка, or I will not speak so loud, Jesus. female, женщина. But I will not call her женщина, because this kind of, we use it for old people, 25 plus, but in a gender variation, we call them женщина, yes, female. And uh, she's девушка, девочка, девочка is for, from zero to 14, and from 14 to, or maybe from 12 to 16, young adult ages, it is dev девушка. And sometimes девушка it is for 16 to 35, you can use it too. It is kind of like a, calling a chick or a girl, You, it is the same thing. Девушка it is kind of middle ages, девочка young ages, super young. And uh, also женщина it is for uh, woman, female. And let's cross the street. It is, by the way, Daroga, a road. And it is, I don't know what's the name of it. Curb, 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 yes. And uh, it is the Bardur. Bardur in Russian language. And also in St. Petersburg we have Parebrik. Parebrik it is the name of him. And uh, do you know what is it? It is a sign, Znak. Znak Avtobusny Astanovki. It is, uh, or something like this, it is for Autobus stop. And uh, it is расписание. Uh, it is the plan. Like, uh, look at this. It is number of a road. Номер маршрута. It is uh, the, the punkt, the punkt назначения. Our destination. And it is метро Сокольники. Сокольники is a name like uh, Igor. And, uh, but uh, in this way. But also Sokol. Sokol means uh, an eagle, and it is boot vich. It means uh, weekends and uh, day weekdays. So, if you want something like this in the next videos, let me know. Really, if you want Russian language lessons th in this way, then let's go. Really, let me know in the comment section below. Would you like to see it or not? Also, it is uh, leaves, listia. Yeah? It is the twigs, vetka, vetki, vetki means in a plural form, vetka in a singular, and it is, I don't know what's the name of it even in Russian, like something with a uh, woda, Wa. vada, vada inside of it, vada in Russian language is water, it is a window, akno, and it is plastic where a window, Pl plastic окно. Plastic окно means uh, plastic window. And also, look, valuta. Valuta in your language is valut. It is architectural type of uh, things. So you can see architecture and uh, you can name it. By the way, sign of an ev evacuator. Evacuator here can go to this place. And it is uh, like, do not, do not place your car here. Дети means children. Children are arriving. It means that it is maybe a school. Yes, it is school number 354 by his, by somebody else's name. And also, what can we see around? It is uh, a fence, hedge or fence, I think so. 
Yes, it is zabor, zabor, and uh, metallic, metallicheski, and uh, kamenny, stoned, kamenny, kamen, from a word. And also we can see here it is uh, look it is kind of a road, but it is made by plitka. Plitka it is stones, small stones. I don't know piles, piles, piles in English. Republic del Ecuador, Embajada. Wow, super! And also, it is School Andrea, School Aquarelli Andrea, Cavoda Tam, Andriaki, or something like this. It is uh, the school for aquarelle, I mean, water watercolors. You can see. And look at this girl, she's with an umbrella, Zontic. Zont, Zontic, it is for like kitty, cat kitty, and Zont, Zontic. Zontic for uh, like kitty way to say. Also, look at this poop here. Poop means uh, in a formal way to say it is fecalia. Fecalia really, it is the formal way to say it. We have kind of different things in, in the, your language the same. If you want to say S-H-I-T word, then you will say it. Also, you can call it a poop, or maybe you can call it excrements, or something like this. In Russian, excrements, we have it too, and also we have fecalia. Excrements, it is uh, really like super scientific way to say it. Fecalia, it means kind of, okay, you can say it too, but excrements, it is really like scientific way to in Russian. What can we see? Earth, земля. Also, trastinka, the small... The, the small twig, trastinka. Trastinka means like a small stick. Small stick is a trust, trastinka. Trost, trost. It is uh, the like a staff of an uh, old man. Like, uh, like uh, <laughs> granny come to here. And uh, what can we see more? Shlagbaum. Shlagbaum. It is a barrier. Cars barrier. And uh, let's translate something that's written here. Look, attention. It is uh, recording. Внимание, ведется видеонаблюдение. Внимание, ворота открываются автоматически. Means the gates are opening automatically. Парковка перед воротами запрещена. It means parking near the opening, like next to, in, in the side of beginning. It is forbidden. Also, what can we see more? And uh, it is house, a doggy, собака, собачка, овчарка, maybe. Овчарка, овчарка is a type of a dog, like we can Dalmatians, something else, I don't know. And uh, yes, we are walking here. Luke. I don't know how to translate it, it is Luke. It is the place for a canalization, opening, opening thing. It is a tool like a, for a pen. No, not a pen or a pen. I mean for a pen, like grilling. It is the closing part, like a door, door to the canalization, Luke, like Luke Skywalker. It is the trunk, and trunk translated to Russian as ствол. Ствол. Ствол also in a jargon way, we call it as a gun. Like you can say ствол, and if you mean something like a, ga a gun, then it will be a gun. A gun. <laughs> also, it is flower garden, or I don't know, клумба. In Russian language you call it машина, a car. Also, лестница, the steps, перила, rails. It is the light, light, then light lamp, lamp, light, street lamp, street lamp, фонарь. It is the name of him. Уличный фонарь, we will call it. Уличный means like street. Улица is a street. Уличный means that adjective from street. Maybe it is a pigeon. Provada, by the way. 
голубь, провода. Кейблс. Кейблс, лайнс, электрик лайнс. Yes, maybe it's a pigeon, because we have a pigeon, pigeon serpentarium or something like this. <laughs> I mean that pigeon, uh, yes, 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 exactly. It is pigeon room. Голубятня. Голубятня means uh, a place for голубь. Голуби. Голуби. A place for голубь. Or гол для голубей. For, for pigeons. Amazing. And it is the specific stolp, stolp trunk, I think so. But electricity here too. Коробка. Коробка means a box. Like I don't know how to call it. It's maybe electricity коробка. Electricity box. Электрическая коробка. But uh, I will call it in Russian. It will be better to say that it is not электрическая коробка. It is коробка с электричеством. Или or the box with uh, electricity tools maybe something else okay so thank you a lot for watching this video it was interesting to show let me know in the comment section did you like it if yes then it's amazing i can go to any places of our Russian to show you places to describe and you will know more vocabulary have a good day in bye bye yes it was Igor. bye